How you doing, sir? How you doing? All right, man. Welcome to Caffeine and Octane Hot Rod Madness style, buddy. Can't walk by a rat rod type vehicle without asking any questions, man. You know who, you know, that's just my thing, right? Yeah, exactly, exactly. Yeah. There's a little bit of everything here. Yeah, what a ride, man. I'm I appreciate that. Really cool fabrication going on here, right, dude. Right, right. How big is that motor? Uh, you know what? That one there is just a 460 early model. Uh, they were like 385 horse. You know, of course, we freshened it up a little bit and done a little bit of work to it. Mm -hmm. And really, it's my test motor. We're, uh, we get all the bugs worked out, and we got a 598 going to go in it from Kazi. Uh, they're working on that right now, and uh, we'll see what she's going to do once we get our, get all the bugs worked out of her. All right. Man, you know, you know, we'd love to see what that thing will do, too. Yeah, well, I'm anxious to see myself. I've, I've had a lot of hot rods and drag cars yeah. and stuff, and yes, uh, sir, it's kind of my thing is... Uh, I like one that'll that I can snatch and jerk it around and mm -hmm. try my best to tear it up. Yes, sir. <laughs> wow. I guess you're gonna find out how good this one is, right? Yeah, yeah. Man, yeah. I'm, I'm it, this one drives hits the road real well. Drives good. Of course, I uh, I drove it here. Uh, you have to get up early to get here. If you don't get up by five and get on over here, you yeah. ain't gonna find a spot. Yeah, I noticed that. This <laughs> is probably the best show that you can come to. It, it don't matter if it's a exotic cars, tuner cars, mm -hmm. car clubs. It don't matter whatever. This is the show. Yeah, right you can here. find it here at Caffeine yes, and Octane. Exactly right. Yes, I mean, sir. if any kind of car you can dream of, it's probably here in one shape, perform, or fashion. Speaking of types of cars, man, where'd that grill come from? A uh, good friend of mine, Jeb Greenstone of Cutworm Specialties. He 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 does a lot of fabrication work, and mm -hmm. uh, him and I sat down and kind of put our heads together, and that's yep. what he he fabricated. That he fabricated the grill shell. Uh, he made the headers and uh, a lot of the interior work on it. He's he's. He's done. Uh, mm -hmm. He's probably up and coming. He's going to be one of your better fabricators in the country as far as being able to make anything you can dream of. I'm familiar with his okay. work. We right. uh, we caught up to him at the Moonshine Cruise Inn right. a couple of years ago in Hiawassee. And when I looked inside <laughs> your vehicle, I'm going, yeah. man, that's cutworm stuff. Yeah, you yeah. knew his work, this guy, didn't you? This guy exactly. knows his cutworm. Yeah, he, so, you, you know. know his work. And yeah. Of course, he's... Yeah, he's making a name for himself. Yeah, he that's is definitely cool. making a name for himself. Yeah. He's a great guy. And, uh, you know, we was not on a time frame when he done this. And, mm -hmm. uh, and of course, it turned out exactly as I hoped it would. Oh, yeah, man. When you're looking at the exhaust on it. Yeah. Step over here, man. Okay. Let's look at this thing. Okay, yeah. That's, uh, look, look, the exhaust on this thing. It's... You got some tornado looking headers yeah, going kinda, in the body and back out the body yeah, behind the door. Just got stupid on that right there. I don't know. We just, well, Jeb said, let's just make it all curvy and swervy. And yeah, I said, hey, yeah. I'm good with that. And then uh, the, he come up with the idea of running it through the cab, which I've never seen anybody do that, and run it out the back of the cab there. And okay. it, yeah, everybody says, oh, it gets hot, but we've heat, heat wrapped it and then we got heat blanket over it. And it's not that bad. A rat rod's hot no matter what anyway. Yeah, you're right. <laughs> It ain't quite got insulation open in it. Open engine, open wheel, you know, there yep. you go. There you go. You, you don't want to watch you pull in and then walk next to it and rub your leg up against it. Yeah, that's it. the now, bad thing get... about it. If I go somewhere, I try to stand <laughs> yeah. around it till it cools off. Right. You know, kids yeah. and stuff like that, Yeah, yeah. they'll wind up burning themselves with yeah, it. Yeah, gotcha. Man, that, I, I'm digging it, boy. The whole, I appreciate that. The overall that. vehicle is just, just really cool. Got a guy, uh, Ronnie Edwards, uh, he's called the sign man. Mm -hmm. He done the lettering on it for me. and. Uh, at, back in the day, he used to letter a lot of the cars at Dixie Speedway and stuff like that, and okay. he's really good at patina work. Matter yes, of fact, sir. I've had to touch up some places on it, and he's even come over to the house and been able to kind of blend it in, and you can't tell it. Okay. The Mountain Magic Speed Shop. Yep. How about that? Yeah. Very cool. Let's take a peek at the interior, man. Wow, there's a lot going on in here, dude. A lot of sheet metal work. Lots yeah, a lot of, lot of Jeb stuff in there, that's yeah. for sure. He's he uh, he designed the steering column in it. If you notice, it's, it's got a tilt wheel in it. It's 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 on a slide, and you can oh, roll yeah. it roll it up and down. That nice. arm at the top pivots. Gotcha. And of course, if I know you probably didn't notice, but the steering box is up inside the cowl on this, and there's nothing but the shaft coming out. Okay. So it, it kind of hit everything in wow. it. Wow, love it. Some man. of his work. The talent, man, that goes into this stuff. Yeah, uh, just that's phenomenal. that's why I've always liked rat rods. Rat rods are kind of to each his own. It don't matter if yep. you can think of it. There's yep. no box on these things. Dream it up and just <laughs> yeah. put it on there. Exactly, by not a box. You, yeah. you do any way you want to do it. And people like Cutworm is just taking it over the top, man. Yeah, doing the, uh, the imagination that goes yeah, into Jeb, it. Yeah, Jeb, he's he's to be be you know not doing it many years and just getting into it. He's got all kinds of good creative ideas. Yes, sir. Well, all right, man. <laughs> I appreciate you. Yes, sir. Good Showing it on Hot Rod Madness today, sir. Right.